Hi guys, you're watching GT channel. This is episode 18 of my Demon Hunter leveling series. So right now I'm on my main quest to go and find Dalgur Oasis. So right now I'm gonna head downstairs I think. Or is it upstairs? Well it looks to me that I'm gonna go downstairs, ruined cistern. Let's just go into this, deeper into the damn cellar. Did you see some yellow mobs attacking? Blast him off with my elemental arrow and oh my god. There's another still alive and I got some kind of achievement. And a new banner I guess. Design of the banner I can get. Let's loot this dead body. Get that blue item. What did I get? Some pens, some new pens, crappy pens with intelligence that I don't need. So let's get in deeper into this place. Kill the damn serpents. Annoying serpent bastards. Keep appearing and appearing in front of me. I'm pretty close to getting a level up. Look at that. I need about like a three small bars and I'm gonna get a level 21. So this is supposed to be the place that I need to go. Let's just jump. Oh, this is quite far away. We are going. I'm gonna lay some traps so they don't attack me, the damn snake bastards. And spam my elemental arrow. Damn them. Take them, all of them down. A big pile of diseased bodies. So there are two ways to go right now. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go left. Some already some more of these invisible serpents incoming at me. Little bugs. So where to go? Damn this this looks to me that this is gonna be quite a big big ruined cistern place. Some chest and a satchel. A book, I guess, again. The twin of Andariel. I believe that they conspired together to assist Diablo in releasing Mephisto and Bale, though they had both supported the lesser evils in the past. The Lord of Pain was found guarding Bale's prison, the tomb of Tal Rasha, when he was slain by heroes. So right now the way again separates in three different ways. Up, down and left. Well I'm gonna go up, I guess. And this is the dead end. So let's go left. Loot the dead body, nothing drop and another dead end. Damn. That's quite annoying. And there is a chest and a dead end again. Ooh, some blue item and some bow. The blue bow. And let's first take down the damn little rats, monkeys, whatever the hell they are. And let's check the bow. Magic bow that is crappier than mine. It has intelligence. Plus 24 intelligence. How lame is that? So I guess I'm gonna go this way. And I'm not gonna go this way. Because I that's another dead end. So I got to go. The only way available is this way. And there's already some blue serpents. Oh my god, you don't have that much discipline, cannot jump away. Take the damn bastard down. And oh my god, they keep coming for me. Templar, go tank, god damn it. You lazy bastard, what are you do waiting for? Damn annoying bastards disappear. Have this invisibility. So let's loot all the gold and get that whatever it dropped. A dagger? No, it's a spear, magic spear. And that's it. So let's go this way. Finally I already see the stairs. Patch to the oasis. Finally. I can get out of these sewers annoying. And it's dark. Why it's dark outside? Damn it. So let's get the waypoint. Is it active or not? Is it activated? I think it's activated. I'm not really sure, but okay, let's go. 
I need to do what uh, is enter the forgotten ruins in Dah Dahlugur Oasis. And there is another book. Love Mephisto, Lord of Hatred, was so pervasive that even after he had been defeated and entombed in a soul stone, his demonic essence oozed upwards into Travanco and corrupted the Zakru priest. Oh shit. Cannot fully read it because I already get attacked by some mobs. There's even more right here. Oh, some new mobs. What the hell are they? Some strange looking guys. Demon. They're demons fallen master. Did I just pick up some, yeah, white item? Go away and there's some kind of fire right here. Let's check it out. Yeah, the fire is here and there is some entrance. The run socket cellar. So where do I need to go? B oh my god! Holy shit, these annoying flowers just took down like 246 life. Wow, that's quite a lot, so I need to be careful. Walking near some deadly flowers. There's another, another cellar here. Holy shit, that exploded, that barrel. Storage cellar, some more flowers, exploding flowers. Well, I think I'm gonna go and I'll go this direction, then go check out that first cellar. Holy shit. Oh my god, that what the hell is that? You dervish, some kind of spinning mob. Holy crap. Some weird shit all over the place. Ooh, wow, a yellow item. So let's loot it and check the first. My achievements in research. I present my findings on the Dune Dervish. It took me many years to find the truth of these strange, deadly figures. But my sources indicate that they are the cursed remains of mages who summoned a demon far beyond their power to control. Well, let's just take down the damn birds. The birds, I was thinking they were like uh, passive moves, but no, they were like flying and attacking me. And I got the yellow item, but it's for barbarian class. So it's totally useless for me. I'm gonna try to sell it at the auction hall. So let's go this way. I'm not sure. What the hell is this? Well, it doesn't look like this is the right way to go. So let's go back and check out the, this location first. I can go down. I think it, this is gonna be like dead end or something like that. Maybe not, I'm not sure. But I see a lot of mobs here at this place. Some little demons. Yes, this is the dead end and there's nothing here. Not even a chest. God damn it. So let's go and check out the first, the first uh, cellar. Run socket cellar. So there are some kind of guards here, or what? Yeah, there are guards and there's NPC desperate villager that has a quest for me. It's a side quest, I think. Please, help! The Imperial guards are in my home. You can't let them find what's in the back room. So why do I need to kill them? Slaves. And you will make a fine corpse. Yeah, all the guards in this game are evil. They transform into the snakes. Let's take the damn bastards and truly noble warrior. Let me show you why this room is so important. So let's see what does this guy have? Some chests? These refugees. I did not know what to do. I am not the warrior my father was. Take whatever you want from his chests. Okay, the chests are free for me. I'm gonna loot the chest one blue item. And the other chest has some crap. You can have the crap, I'm gonna take just the blue item. So let's see what did I get. Ah, some kind of shield. Some crappy shield, that's it. So let's head to the next to the next uh, cellar, yeah? Storage cellar, yeah, this this place, yes, yeah, there's some kind of, maybe there are gonna be some better items stored in this place, but no, there's some goblins, blue, blue demons, 
peons, peons. Fallen peons, the correct name of these creatures. Holy shit, what kind of spells do they cast? Let's take them down. Take all of them down. And there's another merchant. Wow. And these guys sell some blue items. Some blue items and again no bows. What the hell? Why none of them sell any bows for me? Ooh, look at that. Some yellow item. Plus 13 dexterity. Plus 5 extra gold from monsters. Critical hit chance increased by 1%. Wow, this is pretty nice. Holy shit. A rare yellow item that I can buy from NPC. So let's buy it, get it, and I'm gonna wear it. Let's check the other items first before I equip it. And the other items are crap. Yeah, they're crap. Yeah, let's repair. And I just got myself some new bracers. Wow. Pretty nice. Very nice. This is quite a good seller. Because I got some nice items from it. So let's head back and go on my original quest. I need to enter the forgotten ruins in Dalgur Oasis. Well, first I need to find the damn ruins. And kill shitlock mobs first. And oh my god, I almost at level up. Look at that, I need only 400 experience points. So a few more mobs and I'm gonna get a ding. Holy shit, damn annoying exploding plant that does 200 damage. So let's see where to find some more mobs. Come on, come at me, come at me. Give me that level up. I want to get a level 21. I'm not sure why, but I want to get it. And these mobs must give me a level up. Come on, yes, level 21. Take the other ones and some new, new active skill unlocked. And some other crap, yeah, night pain, some kind of rune. New rune, shadow power rune, some kind of. And damn it, and another rune. A lot of skills unlocked, so. Let's take down the damn mobs first before we check the skills. The new skills that I have gotten myself. Demon, little demon, die you bastard. And why? Why do I keep going? I need to. Oh my god. This is quite a strange mob that I see. Okay, these are the final mobs that I'm gonna take down. Let's fall. So, okay, let's go check the skills. The skills. New, new, new. Defensive. So, first the defensive shadow power. It. Uh, Draw in the power of the shadows, gain 20% of all damage done as life for 3 seconds. And the new rune is Nightbane, gain an additional 4 hatred per second while shadow power is active. Well this uh, defensive one, I think I didn't even check it out, so let's check it out. It's gonna replace my Caltrop strap. But first let's... I'd never check this ability out, Shadow Power. So we'll see what it's gonna do. So the hunting, the hunting has new ability, final, the last one. Mark for death. Marks an enemy, the market enemy will take 12% additional damage for the next 30 seconds. 3 discipline. So this one, well, it looks... Uh, Sounds pretty good to me that it's gonna give me additional, additional damage. But the, I think it's only marks one enemy. Well, to me it looks like this Vault ability is better because I can like get away when I'm in a pinch, getting ganged by some, a lot of mobs. So yeah, I think I'm gonna leave my uh, Vault ability. Not gonna take that one. In devices, devices has a wazy fire new new rune. Shrapnel. Shoot exploding bolts that also deal 30% weapon damage as fire to all enemies within 6 yards of primary target. So this one. I'm not really sure. I think I'm gonna leave my fan of knives too. 
Did I get some passive skills? I think I did, yeah, or maybe not. No, I did not. I did not gain any passive skills. I gonna unlock one at level 25. So that's it. Well, let's check the check the shadow power ability. Wow, it looks pretty cool and awesome. For only few seconds. For three seconds. Draw in the power of shadows, gaining 20% of all damage done as life for 3 seconds. So what does it do? Let's uh, find some enemies. Well, okay, gonna first rescue this guy and there are enemies, finally. Do the damage to me, do the damage. What does it do? Do I get some kind of damage or something? I'm not sure what does it do, so screw it, gonna... Put my oh my god damn it! Still one more was alive. Well, let's put my traps back, and with my tortures ground rune, except and that's it. So that guy gives a quest, but first I need to explore. Well, no, let's go take the damn quest. Side quest. Guards left me here to die, but you saved me. Thank you. Wow. He just dropped some long stuff on the floor. White item. What the hell do I have a white crude arbor list in my inventory and some long stuff. It's crap. So well let's first uh, go down. I need more discipline. Go here because there's some little unexplored place. Damn it, do I get some kind of lack or something? I have quite a low latency. Why do I get this? Jump backs. Some, oh my god, there's a lot of them here. Lay some traps and take the blue bastards down. The annoying goddamn demons. Wow, some of them dropped some blue item. But first let's take them down, all of them down. Get that item and that's it. Holy shit, it's gonna explode. So let's go this way first. Oh my god, this place looks like totally massive place that I will need to a lot of time to fully explore it and find the damn forgotten ruins for my quest, for my main quest. So finally I have found the forgotten ruins that I need to go. Damn, this place was insanely huge, just look at this map, holy shit, I've almost fully explored it. There is a little place here that I didn't explore because I think this is the... After I go into these forgotten ruins, I think I gonna... I have to go cross this bridge and go somewhere else. But I gonna be doing that in some later episodes. So thanks for watching. Bye.